So guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, this video, um, I just found out a little something and got it figured out, and I've been trying to work on it for a bit. And so I bought a um, S a, a portable SSD card so I can just plug it into my laptop. This is just a TV to have an external uh, monitor, uh, extended monitor. I'm sorry. Um, but I wanted to be able to plug it into my laptop so then, um, I would have extra RAM and space because I only have in total is 237 gigabytes and I only have that much free with literally just one, two, I got two games, uh, literally on that one plus other apps that I've downloaded, obviously. But, uh, part of that was just these two games here. But you may see this game up here, Happy uh, Humbled Burger Game, and uh, but it's not going onto my external hard drive. It's not on there. It's actually onto my connected USB drive. And at first, just going through Steam settings, trying to look at the camera and doing this. So I know that you're all looking at what I'm looking at. Uh, and then you hit Steam Library Folders, and it'll show you what the games are and all that. And you can hit Add and be able to add your USB. But at first, before you do what I'm going to show you guys to do, and you try to, you know, hit Download. Alright guys, sorry about that pause, my video just stopped. But anyways, as I was saying, um, when you hit install and then you automatically just try to click um, down here and use your USB and hit next, um, it would usually get up an error message saying you can't use that as um, to download things onto, um, even if it was free. Um, so I'm going to just show you guys on how to uh, be able to do that. Uh, first, you would want to either delete everything or, like, you know, save everything on your USB flash drive and put it somewhere safe or use a, you know, brand new uh, USB drive. And so what you want to do is first, obviously, plug in your USB flash drive and go to File Explorer. And, um, again, check to make sure it, that your, oops, that's not it. Your uh, thing is uh, empty. I say I just have Steam Library, and that's what it would automatically will put into your file or your USB drive um, to be able to download these things. Uh, so you go to your this PC, and you'll see your USB drive. There's sometimes uh, another one here that'll be like Untitled or whatever. Uh, that would be it to just check uh, and go ahead and right click on it and go ahead and hit Format. And it'll pop up this little message here. Um, I, I just left everything the same. I don't know why it's on that. It should be just on default, but I guess that's the default. I guess 16 kilobytes. Um, and if you don't know if anything has changed, you can just hit restore default device defaults, and then go ahead and hit start. Now I already did it. It will bring up a message saying it will permanently delete everything. Um, and so that's why I don't want to do it because I have a game installing for one and I already have done it. Um, but just go ahead and hit start. And then um, it, you really don't even have to restart your computer. I didn't. And then when you go to your Steam and you click Steam. You know, I'm using cameras for this. Hit settings. Go to downloads. Hit Steam Library. It would probably just have your regular SSD, or the external one. Uh, just go ahead and hit that, and then um, it will have you do other things. But I already have this, so you just hit New Folder, and um, it will bring up another big message. And then you can be able to click on from. It would have it look like that. You just click on it, and that big message hit uh, the your USB. And I actually, I just realized um, it does say ESD. I don't know what that means, but it didn't say that before I even formatted it. So that does, I guess, make a difference. Um, but yeah, so if you get like a one terabyte, you know, USB flash drive, do this. And you can get a lot of them for cheap online. 
Um, and, you know, you would have basically uh, kind of good amount of storage without having to spend lots and lots of money on a, um, what do you call them, uh, portable or another external uh, SSD card to add more storage. Um, I did add or bought a portable SSD, but that's only because this one, this USB only has 28 gigabytes of storage. And what I bought has 500 extra gigabytes um, on top of what I already have on my external SSD card, which is 200. So we'll make it about 700. Uh, and if I leave my USB drive and everything and connect everything together, it'll be about over 800 gigabytes of storage for just using my USB drive, my. Um, when I get my portable drive and my external drive. And that's, well, that's basically how you do, you get free storage of getting um, games and having more storage on it, having better RAM. I don't know if actually it does, I don't know if it performs better in games. I've been doing research on that, but if you do know if it does, leave a comment down below and let me know. I really appreciate it. And the reason why I have to do this on my, uh, phone is because um i don't have any screen recorders on my computer at the moment um but i will i don't like using obs anymore so i'm trying to find a better one if you know one better than obs again leave in the comments down below thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoy this one